All right, I'm here at Fight Ready MMA with the Olympian, Mark Madsen, who has a fight coming up against Vince Pichel. Mark, uh, good training in today. I saw you out there sparring with uh, Kelvin Gastelum, who's now training here. How was, uh, how was that? Amazing. Yeah. Kelvin is an amazing fighter. I mean, uh, there's a lot of stuff that I can pick up during practice. And you know what they say, if you want to be the best, you have to, to go with the best. So, I mean, Kelvin is definitely one of the guys that I'm going to be working out with uh, in my preparation, but also just being here and Fight Ready. Yeah, second camp uh, with Fight Ready. Um, definitely, now that you've been here a little while, the right choice, you think, for your career? Absolutely the right choice. I don't believe I can get what I'm getting here anywhere else in the world. This is truly a, a world champ camp uh, fight gym. Yeah, as we've seen, you know, title fight last weekend. There's another one coming up for the gym uh, in a couple of months. In uh, UFC 273, you'll be fighting Vince Pichel. This fight was supposed to happen, I think, a little sooner, right? It got it got kind of pushed back. What happened there? Was it an injury or travel issue? What was the, the delay for? Well, we had a little bit of a, a, a lack from uh, the whole last year. Was I was busy with a lot of lot of things. My wife got diagnosed with the uh, MS disease. We had a house that had to be rebuilt. Uh, I mean, I've been putting everything I could into just getting ready, getting settled, um, and actually also preparing for. Uh, a big, a big thing for my family and I, uh, which is uh, we're actually moving out here to, to Arizona, recreating. Um, we're doing a, a two-year title run, so I'm bringing the whole family out here, and uh, and we'll be going 100% at it. So a little bit of, of stuff going on back home that I needed to to shut down, but we're here and uh, I'm ready to go. Yeah, is that an exciting move for your family? Is it a difficult one? Is it? Uh, what is kind of the vibe for you guys? Is it is it, it during this time that you're going to be moving out here? I mean, it is exciting yeah. to say the least, right? It, one thing is, I believe as an American, a lot of people are traveling around from state to state. This is this is changing a country. This is moving from one country to another country, and I have to be honest. I live a very comfortable life in Denmark, and and you know, making that decision, making that commitment, not only to move myself out here but also my family. It's a, it's a massive decision, but everyone is excited. Uh, I'm very excited. And uh, I think this decision is, is all about, you know, really um, putting myself in a position to develop my maximum potential. That's what it's all about. And uh, that's why I'm calling it a title run, a two-year title run. Yeah, I like that, man. So is that kind of, I mean, you mapped it out right there. Is that kind of the game plan for you? Um, you know, a lot was made about, oh, he's starting later, he's coming after his wrestling career, and you've killed it so far. But is that kind of what you're saying is like, hey, I need to do it in these next two years? I think what I'm saying is I just moved from one country to another country. I'm joining the best fight gym out there right now. I have guys like the captain, Henry Cejudo, Santino, Eddie. I mean, that's on the coaching side. And then you have guys like <laughs> Kelvin Gastelum, Zombie, whom, whom I'm also fighting on the same card as. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I've put myself in a in a position, in a path um, to go where I want to go. And uh, ultimately, I want to be the UFC lightweight champion. Yeah, and you're on your way. Um, Vince Pichel is the, the, next, uh, the next person standing in your way. You've had some time to study him with the rebooking and everything. I guess, what are you kind of expecting to see out of him when you guys get in there? I'm expecting a fight. And also, I'd love to rip that mustache off. I mean, I, I think it's a gorgeous mustache, but Jesus, I'm excited. And I mean, I've seen some fights of Vince, and he's a, you know he's an exciting fight. He's a tough guy, and I'm excited to get in there and, and get the work done. Let's show the world. Let's give the world a, fa a fight. Yeah, and you've already beaten some tough guys in MMA, but do you feel like that he's kind of the next step up? Like he's you know the best guy that you fought t t to date. To be honest, I don't focus too much on Vince. Yep. What I focus on is what I have to do to put myself in, in the best possible position. Uh, I focus on training, eating, sleeping, and ultimately knocking people out. That's what I need to, to be focusing on. Vince is, uh, is there right now. He's a, he's a task. He's a job. April 9th. Yeah, and I guess uh, let's let's go off of that then. For you, uh, we always talk to fighters that are coming off a loss. We'll be like, oh, what did you need to do differently? What did you need to improve? But I'm sure you can take some stuff out of wins as well. Is there something from your last couple fights that you're like, man, I really need to make this the focus when I go in there against Vince. I need to fix this, tweak this. Has there been a specific focus? Yeah, I, I'm I'm still undefeated in, in MMA. I've, I've been wrestling my entire life. 
it's been a it's been a short journey uh, in MMA, but I'm still undefeated. But I'm keeping a white belt mentality. I, I want to adjust everything. I want to be better at everything, not only MMA wrestling, but jujitsu, stand up naturally, boxing, kickboxing, Muay Thai. I want to be better at everything. That's why I'm here. That's why I'm making the commitment, moving my family out, moving myself out, joining the right environment. I mean, we used to have a saying go that was surround yourself with people on the same path and and to be honest i really believe that's what i'm doing right here awesome mark well i appreciate your time uh, good luck with everything good luck with the move and of course best of luck in the fight thank you